heart of our planet lies a vast tropical belt, an incredible region that encompasses approximately 40% of the Earth's surface and is home to nearly 40% of the world's population. This expansive zone stretching between the tropics of Cancer and Capricorn is not only a breathtaking paradise of biodiversity, but also a crucial engine of our planet's climate. Research has revealed it to be the global climate modulator, influencing the Earth's climate on a grand scale. However, CO2 emissions have been rocketing globally. Despite international agreements to curb greenhouse gas emissions and the tropics have borne a disproportionate share of the burden. Climate change has hit the tropics hard, leading to severe air and water pollution, as well as a cascade of disaster events, ecosystem degradation and resource loss. The tropics house over two-thirds of global terrestrial biodiversity, even though they cover only 7% of the world's land surface. However, this biodiversity is now severely declining, with many ecosystems now at risk of collapse. This has affected both the environment and the people who call the tropics their home. The ever-increasing impact of climate change negatively affects their livelihoods, education, agriculture productivity and overall well-being. With economic growth declining, the region has seen an increase in debt service, a stark warning sign of future debt crisis. This crisis affects some countries more than others, leaving disproportionate and devastating impacts in its wake. Sri Lanka needs your support as do our neighbours in the tropics. The main driver of resource use in the tropics is not population growth, but consumption patterns. High-income countries consume over 10 times more resources per capita than low-income countries, and this growing use of natural resources, many of which originate in the tropics, has caused pressing challenges. Resource extraction and processing cause over 90% of global biodiversity loss and water stress and more than half of the effects of global climate change. Despite the tropics contributing significantly to the global economy through global value chains, socio-economic disparities persist. These resource imbalances coupled with the region's uh, significant environmental and social impacts place the tropics in a resource-constrained position. The tropics simply cannot afford to address all these issues on its own. To address these imbalances and tackle climate change, the tropics urgently require global support, investments in renewable energy, nature-based solutions and pollution control is essential. At COP28, Sri Lanka as a tropical nation weighed down by this poly crisis, urges the global north to look beyond geopolitical affiliations and support our efforts to mitigate the triple planetary crisis. This is a reminder that the well-being of the tropical belt is inseparable from the future of our planet. The tropics are not just in need of assistance, but are a catalyst for solutions to the ongoing triple planetary crisis. Investments in the tropics are investments in global progress. Placing nature at the heart of development, through UNDP's Nature Pledge, we make commitments to empower our citizens and transform our global systems to meet vital targets, protect and restore our planet, eradicate poverty, reduce gender and other inequalities, protect human rights, and accelerate overall progress on our global goals. As we strive to protect the tropics, remember that like the endless embrace of a tropical sunset, our united efforts can bring warmth, hope 
and a brighter future to our world.